Police in Malaysia have revealed that traces of the deadly VX nerve agent has been found on the body of the man widely believed to be Kim Jong-nam. The discovery of this chemical agent, which is banned under international law, almost certainly proves Kim was murdered. Hwan jong ho has our top story. The Royal Malaysian Police have confirmed that VX nerve agent was discovered on the body widely believed to be Kim Jong-nam, the half-brother of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. In a press statement on Friday, it said a preliminary report was received from the chemistry department where the deadly chemical was found on Kim's face and eyes. This confirms reports that two female suspects had wiped a poison on Kim's face, whereupon he died on the way to the hospital. VX is an extremely toxic man-made chemical agent only used in chemical warfare. It's been banned under the Chemical Weapons Convention and is more powerful than sarin. It's odorless and tasteless and it can be inhaled, ingested or absorbed through the skin and it can kill in a matter of minutes. Although it can cause an immediate reaction on contact with skin, it can be washed off. This corroborates reports that the two attackers went to the bathroom immediately after the incident to wash their hands. Those two suspects, one Vietnamese woman and one Indonesian woman, have been arrested and are in custody, as is a North Korean male. Seven more North Korean men are being sought, several of whom are believed to have masterminded the killing. Pyongyang has vehemently denied any involvement in the incident, accusing the Malaysian authorities of conspiring against it with South Korea. But the South Korean government has noted that such a denial by the regime has had several precedents, such as the bombing of the Korean air flight in 1987 and the sinking of the warship Chunan in 2010. Because they're not in a position to admit to their crimes, they have no choice but to come out like this. But they need to be aware that the more they act this way, the worse their image will become in the international community. Meanwhile, Malaysia's Deputy Inspector General of Police has suggested that a member of Kim's family could be arriving in the country to verify his body by the weekend. The authorities have been unwilling to name the victim as Kim Jong-nam until his identity has been confirmed by a family member with a DNA test. Kwon Jang-ho, Arirang News.